We are in Urington, Nevada. It's coming close to 12 o'clock and it's probably in the upper 80s. So the temperature is climbing fast and out here going toward Urington and those areas, the temperature does tend to climb. So what we're gonna do, welcome to Urington and welcome to the next video. I hope you like it. Um, without any further ado, I'm gonna flip this thing around and let you guys take a look at downtown Urington. It's epic. Let's do this. Okay, well the downtown Main Street here, pretty busy right now. Of course, it's lunch hour and people are out and about. There's no real historical buildings down here that I can see, but there are buildings and this is downtown. So we're gonna start with this side and take a look at everything that's all around us. And I hope you guys like it. As I've stated, I don't have an expensive camera. This is a cheapy little Samsung phone that I paid probably $7 for, $70 for. Now here's the courthouse. And this is pretty much one end of town right here. Here's the courthouse right here for Lyon County. I'll get a better shot of that probably from across the street. The sun really is in a good spot. Just overhead, so that helps. And then we'll get more. The phone seems to have gone wonkers. So, let's see what we got here. Okay, we got the Ten Commandments. And then whatever this is, let's take a look. Let's see. Lyon County Post for the American Legion. The veterans, okay, well, that's cool. Urington, unlike other towns, was not established because of silver. Urington is a farming community, and uh, that's pretty much what they have here is farming. Here you go, city of Urington. This one looks official. So let's go this way. Across one side to the other. Oh yeah. Let's uh what people don't stop here, do they? Man. And now uh, here you go. That could be my shot right there. I just saw, uh, found, oh, maybe not, okay. Well, let's see if we can get a good one of this, and then I'll use this as my, as my shot. So I love the buildings. So I might be able to use that. Okay. Ooh, it's nice over here, it's in the shade. That's the block I was just on. That's pretty much where town ends, and then it just kind of goes off into farmland. But like I was saying, Urington, I, I think it based most, or it's founded mostly as a farming community. This is a Mexican market now. Yeah, Just across the street. I think they still, they're still pretty heavy into the farming. They do a lot of onions here and hay and alfalfa. Pretty rich farming community. Second hand store. Okay. Like I said, there's not a whole lot going on here as far as buildings. So we'll just walk around and get what we get. And then I'm thinking from here, I might boot scoot over to over to Lovelock. about an hour and a half from here. Not too bad. A&H insurance. 
that's probably this block right here from there to there is probably the only original building in this town or set of buildings that one does look like it's original so eh, maybe I can make that into a shot I don't know let's see we got here let me, let me zoom in I don't like zooming with this thing sometimes because it just goes bananas on me but it is what it is okay Maybe one of these days I'll <clears throat> be able to fork out the money and get a real camera. But this thing does fine. I like the filing system on it. I downloaded it onto my computer and all the files are in order. That's where I had lunch at, Pioneer Crossing. It's a good hamburger. I ordered medium, I got medium. Fries weren't overcooked, they were tasty, lightly seasoned, they were good. Looks like we got another old building or old looking building right down here. We'll go after that. Got a motel. Now they have off road rallies here, and sometimes this place is packed full of people doing their rallies. And with their cars that are all jacked up and this side of the street's comfortable. This side doesn't really have a lot going on. Just the motel and got a Rexall here. Boy, I haven't seen one of those in a while. And like a lot of these small towns. The places without deep pockets end up shut down. Yeah, bowling alley here, I guess. This is gift shops. Here we go. Bulletin board. I always like looking at these. See what's here. Okay, there's a cheap for sale. Okay. Okay, well that's cool. Here's a U.S. post office. None of them there are foreign post offices. Well, this is nice here. It's comfortable. Nice big tree. Yeah. It does get hot here though, so. It gets into the hundreds. Here's a Yerington, Nevada post office. And then over here. Now that says the bank. I don't know if it actually was a bank at one time or. And then we got this right over here. This is a casino. I've never eaten in there, but I hear it's the place I did eat. It was good. I did find a real estate office and show you guys what the real estate is around here. I'm not anti-social. I'm selectively social. There's a difference. I like that. Okay. Here's a look downtown. Yeah, Urington's not anything spectacular, but it's Urington. And I dare say that's pretty much about it. Here you go. So Elvis is alive. There he is. He's, a, he's in a window. That is a dance studio. Surprise. Okay. And believe it or not, Ladies and gentlemen, that's it. There's a couple of buildings down there, and got town right here. And oh, there's an old building. Look at that. I just found something. 
Ooh. Go down a side street and see what you find, right? And of course, we got the Masons. <laughs> the Freemasons. There they are. Man, those lads are everywhere, aren't they? Look at that. Let the conspiracies fly. Yeah, look at this. This is cool. I kind of like that. Yeah. That's fun. Let's get a good angle. And... Uh, I don't want that other building in. That looks good, huh? Okay. Let's go take a look at it. It's stone. It looks old. Looks like it's had some work to, done to it. Looks like this used to be a door or something. Yeah, it was. You can still see the door. They plastered over it. Okay, here's the back. Yeah, kind of a cool old building here. I don't think it's super old, but it's old enough. Old enough uh, to raise an eyebrow. And then of course you got your modern stuff going on right there. That building over there has a archaic appearance, but it's not. It's a relatively modern building. So I think what I'll do is cross the street and get an angle. What is this? Urington Chamber of Commerce. Okay. At least they're open. Let's go across the street, shall we? Let's see. Then I'll give you a shot of the other side a little better. Yeah, having a good day today. Just out getting the sunshine, getting videos of these places I've been wanting to come back to. But you know, time tends to have its way with you. Okay, that's that casino that I did not go into. It's called the Lucky Club. No particular reason, it's just I didn't. And like everybody else, they need help. So here's that block of buildings across the street, right there. Okay. the post office. The clock, yeah, it's 10 minutes to 12. That's a big rooster. In case anybody was looking for a giant rooster, this is where it is. It's at the Red Rooster Emporium. This says the bank. I don't know if it was a bank. I don't see any placards. So let's wrap this up and get out of here. There really isn't much more left anyway. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. So for now, have a good one. And I'll catch you up on the next video, which I'm hoping is in Lovelock. All right, friends. I'll see you later.